Hello, this is Larry Stoll from Pace again, and this is a good time of year. This is in the late spring, it's in, in June, and in a lot of areas of the country, weather conditions are getting warm enough to where we're starting to see a lot of different diseases pop up. And one of the ones we really like, uh, well, not that we really like, I mean, but one of the diseases that for pathologists is kind of interesting, has been brown ring patch uh, over the years. and. What's happening um, now is we got a sample in earlier today. It's like six hours ago, and uh, this is what the sample looks like. And you can see there's a there's a ring uh, going on through the sample, and in that six hours time, uh, the fungus has really grown quite a bit. When we first received the sample, we couldn't see any uh, mycelium, but now it's uh, it's quite distinct. You can't see it just from the surface shot. We'll take a quick look under the uh, under the dissecting microscope. Uh, to show you what we're seeing and throw it under the uh, compound scope and then we'll take a look at it again in another say oh 12 hours uh, just to see what's going on but for now let's just uh, take a look at it under the dissecting scope and you'll see that the mycelium is just starting to grow and then uh, tomorrow we'll take a, a closer look at the sample. Well the sample doesn't look like much but if you look down amongst the foliage you can see a little bit of hyphae in there and what we're going to do is uh, stick in a thumbtack so that we can come back and look at this same area in another 12 hours so we'll know that we're in the exact same spot. So I'll just pan around this real quick and you don't see much uh, but there's a little bit of mycelium and we're going to focus on that little bit of a seed head forming right there and we'll take a look at this in another 12 hours. Well it's been about 12 hours. We incubated the sample in one of the standard uh, shoebox incubation chambers and now we'll see if uh, we've got some mycelium growing more than we saw yesterday. And with brown ring patch, uh, it usually grows pretty fast. And I think you can even see it. I think you can see the mycelium around the edge of the sample and onto the top of the sample. And we're just going to take a, uh, a quicker look certainly back in these areas you can see it uh, where we put this pin so we can get back to the same spot that we were we were looking at uh, yesterday so let's take a look at that sample again and see what we can uh, what we can find well there's that same seed head and you can see the mycelium now pretty dramatically only after only 12 hours of incubation and if we zoom in a little bit more closely with the dissecting scope we can even start to see some of the right angle branches here and there uh, as you see the mycelium uh, take off in, in different directions. Then if we take a sample of this material, uh, collect some of the hyphae and we spread it out on a microscope slide, we'll see the more characteristic components of the fungus. This right angle branching and the septa, these arrows are marking uh, the septa around that branch. We hope you enjoyed this video and refer to the Pace Turf references for additional information on brown ring patch.